a fellow Call of Duty Elite Gaming Stud Muffin athletes, welcome to the video. I am the Ghost of Eight, and we have breaking news. Ricochet anti cheat Call of Duty totally 100% chalk. The no one is being banned. Everyone is getting banned, and then everybody is getting unbanned. Anybody and everybody who's ever cheated in Call of Duty's account has somehow been unbanned. I have just had and double checked on my Activision account, which was permanently banned back in September 28th, 2020, when engine owning got detected, and my account has now been on permabanned. That has happened since Activision so-called reversed and patched this exploit. I believe that they have unbanned every single account that has ever been banned in Call of Duty. That's correct. As you can see, Bad Boy Beeman, who was permanently banned, rightfully so, his account has been unbanned, along with all the other known and proven cheaters and hackers. It's Hoppa, who used to be a rage hacker before becoming a hacker hunter. His account has been unbanned as well. Activision has to be smoking rock. I just found out several hundred permabanned accounts of the same user from Modern Warfare are no longer banned for any COD title except Modern Warfare 2019. What the fuck are we doing? Did they just say F it? Let the cheaters play Black Ops 6 too? And his account was also unbanned. Hopper, that is, I just mentioned. So all these people who have been known cheaters and hackers in Call of Duty were all unbanned because of the situation that happened with all of these call of duty activision may or may not be paid shills and activision streamers otherwise known like bobby poff and all these people face swag and yo whoa etc etc dudes who've ever been banned or who have ever been shadow banned the answer was oh yeah hey guys it's ricochet anti-cheat made a mistake so we're just going to unban everybody to change this and rectify the error dude what the fuck is going on here man like is call of duty just done like is it done this is a catastrophe for anybody who knows what's going on unfortunately a lot of people are not going to be privy to this information who aren't on social media who are just regular dudes who are just going to go and play call of duty and then wonder why their lobbies are completely chalked and filled with cheaters because there's another problem here that I haven't mentioned. All these dudes who've been cheating and have been hacking in the last, you know, five years and then they were banned. Well, their accounts now are reset because they haven't played for so long because they're such old accounts that when they play Black Ops 6, it'll be like the reverse boosting where you put into like the .07 lobbies with special needs and horrible players. It's just going to be a nightmare. It's a gong show. Like Black Ops 6 and what's going on in the future of Call of Duty with the anti-cheat, how it was hacked. Apparently, that's the excuse that was given by people as to why people like Bobby Poff and whatnot were banned. And then now their excuse is, well, all the cheaters are going to be unbanned now. So I don't think there's any way to rectify this. Hopefully, if we're being devil's advocate here, when these banned accounts actually try to log on again and play, Activision's ricochet anti-cheat will recognize what's going on and ban them instantly because they may be on a list. I do not know. But at this point, it looks like a very bad situation for Call of Duty, and especially Black Ops 6 dropping in the next uh, three or four days, I guess, is on the 25th, like less than a week. And all these accounts have been unbanned, and people are being banned, apparently, unrightfully so, and then they're getting unbanned, and then now we've got a circle jerk of just ridiculousness of cheaters and non-cheaters apparently being banned and unbanned. And having Call of Duty on PC and just crossplay in general and the anti-cheat system they've got for Black Ops 6 and for Call of Duty just seems like a gong show out here. Because as well, because as well, Black Ops 6 was old bragging or Activision was bragging furthermore about how Black Ops 6 anti-cheat has been upgraded. That's right. They said Black Ops 6 anti-cheat has been upgraded and that they've got new AI learning tools that will detect cheaters better and they're going to be awesome and it's going to be amazing and Black Ops 6 is going to be the most level playing field fair call of duty ever guys it's gonna be awesome trust me make sure you pre-order now and get yourself a bundle to skin on a first person shooter that you can't fucking see that's how it works out here it's easy to tr sell junk to morons god what the what's going on out here man what the hell bro this is ridiculous this is really actually bad like i'm not even trying to pump it up or this is pretty bad bro it's pretty bad all right well that's the video ghost of eight here signing out thanks for watching Stay black, question Thor and Hunter Cracker Ten Shades of the Moon, 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 Hunter Cracker Ten Shades of the